In the CIC protocol, the term federated model means a reference model consisting of connected but distinct individual models creating a highly collaborative workflow process. Each discipline is responsible for creation, development and change management of their model where responsibilities, ownership, level of detail is clearly defined in particular to BIM Level 2 requirements. The Industry Foundation Classes IFC data model developed by Building Smart is an open, neutral and standardised specification for building information modelling data exchange. The IFC format is registered by ISO as ISO PAS 16739 and is soon to be an official international standard. Open BIM is a universal approach to the collaborative design and operation of buildings based on open protocols and workflows. IFC can be used to exchange and share BIM data between applications developed by different software vendors without the software having to support numerous native formats. Coordination View was the first model definition developed by Building Smart and is currently the most widely implemented of the IFC scheme. From the 1st of January 2013, BRE has taken over the running of Building Smart within the UK. For even more accurate model mapping and when collaborating with structural programs, you can export your model to IFC format and filter according to a criteria. For example, all will include all elements from the model, structural will include only the structural elements, and HVAC will include only the mechanical elements. The main purpose of the coordination view is to allow sharing of building information models amongst disciplines of architecture, structural engineering and building services. It contains definitions of spatial structure, building and building service elements that are needed for coordinating design information. The IFC 2x3 coordination view is the built-in and default standard by vendors such as Graphisoft and their flagship BIM product Archicad. Here you will see two IFC models, reference 1 and reference 2, showing the structural engineer's model inside the architectural model and highlighting the new, deleted and modified structure elements. In the following example, the federated model workflow for architectural and structural engineering has been used using IFC as the common platform. Archicad has been used for the architectural discipline and Tecla structures for the structural. Okay, here we are in Archicad with a background image showing the project and the location taken from a rendered model with some additional work in Photoshop. This model is the basis of that visualization showing the full architectural model. What we can do is filter out some of the information to leave the structural model of one building type. The information shown is limited to what is needed by the structural engineer. To export this model, we can go to Save As and select an IFC file. In this case, instead of using a general translator, we can select the translator for Tecla structures as we know the engineer is using Tecla. There are a few other predefined translators for Revit structure, Revit MEP, Bentley, so that the exported model can be fine tuned for the software being used. We can now see that the structural model in Tecla after the import process has been created by referencing the architectural model and converting elements as required. This can then be exported to an IFC file and referenced back into the architectural model in Archicad. Here back in Archicad we can see the full architectural model of one building type. We can also display the engineer's model which we are using as a reference. Here we have the engineer's model of the entire scheme. We can also view these in section. Firstly the architectural model and now the structural model. We can also display one of these as a trace reference behind the other model. If we zoom in we can see that these columns don't quite align so this can be corrected. The splitter can also be used to swipe across the screen to show the trace reference underneath helping to compare the two models. In this case we can compare how the structural slabs align to the different materials within the architectural model. The display order can also be flipped, displaying the reference on top of the model showing the architectural slabs underneath. 
The federated model is the preferred method of collaboration in the UK and is the easiest of the workflows to implement. Utilising open protocols, designers, engineers, contractors, subcontractors and manufacturers work on one information model referencing data from each other's. For end users of IFC compliant software, it is essential to know that the product they are using is generally interoperable. As well as clear ownership, the federated model can be used for many purposes, including validation, class detection, COVID data drops and marketing.